All right, guys, so guess where I ended up at? I'm at the... guys welcome back to the vlog it is officially the day after why well, i wanted to say thanksgiving <laughs> the day after fourth of july and the sun is sunny nonetheless we are out and about it's about 10 30 in the morning my kids are home and don't watch my nails because my nails look rough but the nails are clean nonetheless okay um yeah so yesterday was dope yesterday was i you know what i'm saying like we ate we were grateful I wasn't in the hospital we were around family so we are forever grateful for that um, food was delicious. Food was amazing. Guys, I decided last minute that I'm not going to do a whole bunch of things. So I kept it really, really simple. And my mom was like, why don't you do this? And I was like, uh-uh. No. It's pouring. You know, we didn't start early. We started like around 4.30, I want to say. 4.15-4.30, ish, like turn on the grill. So we made hamburgers, hot dogs. Um, chicken, barbecue chicken, regular chicken, you know, we put the barbecue sauce on it, and ribs. And, and that was that. So, I just really just kept it really simple. I didn't make the shish kebab, I made potato salad. Actually, I made a little steamed vegetable on the grill. I put it in foil. It had potatoes, carrots, and green beans in it. So... <clears throat> was just to be things and the kids just slapped the chicken and was done like i'm so happy i didn't make all that extra stuff sometimes you just really have to do that guys food is very expensive things are very expensive it's summertime the kids are home all day so yeah the oliva cooking yeah mm -mm. no and these kids they don't want to eat what they had yesterday they want something else to eat so be very, very moderate about the portions that you're cooking because, listen, throwing food in the garbage ain't it, okay? It ain't it. So I'm on my way to Starbucks really quick to grab me a bite to eat and then something to drink. It is extremely hot outside and I'm going to go buy some shampoo. I'm going to go to the beauty supply store this morning and then head back home. So that's what I'm doing right this second. Um, I'm going to go ahead and check my calendar to see what upcoming appointments I do have because I think my parents have an appointment and my kids have a dental appointment as well. So let's go to Starbucks. I haven't been here, I want to say, in over a month and a half. So I'm excited. Let's go. Can I have a caramel ribbon crunch frappuccino? Sure, what size would you like? I'll do a tall, please. Tall caramel ribbon crunch? Anything Correct. else? And I'm going to do a turkey, turkey bacon cheddar and egg white sandwich. Turkey bacon? Yes, please. Right. Uh, that would be all. Can I have it double toasted? Oh yeah, absolutely. Thank you. Alright, that's gonna be $10.95. You can pull it up. Thank you. Some buttered our food. Thank you. I have 10 cents. Thank you. 
Thank you. Have a great day. Bye. Bye. Alright, guys. So, I do need gas. Let me pull over really quick. Really quickly. Of course, I'll pull over in the sun because I'm just that crazy. fix my food because I don't like when the turkey bacon is on one side Ooh, it's hot it's very very hot my husband's telling me so I call you back so guys like I said I'm going to the beauty supply store real quick so So I'm on my way home and I completely forgot to pick up the phone, pick up the camera when I went inside the store to get the stuff. So before I go inside, I'm definitely going to show you guys what I got. Um, nonetheless, I just had a really, uh, what should I say? A bird just hit my window shield. Today is July 5th. Um, first things first, my grandmother died about 12 years ago, um, July 7th. And a bird just hit my window, and I say that to say because it can only mean two things. Someone close to me is gonna pass away. Kinda have an idea, but I'm really praying. <sighs> praying that it's not so, or it can mean something immaculate is gonna happen in my life, so. Nonetheless, I prayed about it. I called my husband, I told him about it. My husband is such a positive person, everything is like he's gonna turn it into positive. He goes, Oh, that's cool. That's not a bad thing, it's not a bad thing. But I think this is the second time in my life actually that a bird has hit my window shield. The first time that the bird hit my window shield, I actually cracked it, actually cracked my window shield. Um, the bird's leaf and everything was all over the place. Um, something very, 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 very traumatic happened in my life. And then, today, uh, yeah, a bird hit my window shield and it rolled off the top of the car. And the cars behind me just ran over it. So... here today that's the plan I'm gonna 
gonna take her hair out today. I was gonna let it air out, but I might not let it air out. I might just wash it and just put it back in the style because it's summertime. And I think I wanna take my kids to the pool. I think, but I might not because I do wanna get them wet. Like, you know, find something with water, you know, incorporated so that they can, you know, get wet or whatever. It's uh, officially, officially, officially summer break for them. Eric is no longer going to her program. It's over. Alexander's been on vacation, but now, you know, we still gonna keep up. I do have to show you guys that as well. Um, I did a schedule for him, a summer schedule for him. So he'll wake up in the morning, fix his bed, have breakfast, workout. He can choose to eat breakfast first, or he can choose to work out first. So workout means that he has to do 50, 50 jumping jacks, um, he usually has to do laps around the house and some jump rope. It is just really that simple. Um, usually what I would have them do is like a kid's YouTube video in the evening, like right before their last shower. I didn't incorporate that on the schedule, but I think I, I am going to because they will not be going to any summer camp, summer school, summer nothing. They'll just be um, hanging out at home. Um, these are some things that I had did during COVID time to keep them active and it worked pretty well. Um, right now we're just in the gist of getting back into the groove of that schedule because Alexander just wants to be on his phone. So Monday through Friday, I have decided that he, his on the schedule tells him when he can use his phone, usually around 6 p.m. Um, I don't want to be too, too strict with it only because sometimes his friends call him and they want to play Fortnite together but nonetheless I think I'm still gonna keep that to or I'm still gonna keep that to a Friday Saturday Sunday thing and then during the week um, Monday through Thursday like you know if he wants to play before bed during his TV time he can do that but nonetheless it's not gonna be you no know, wake up like these kids call my house at 6 30 in the morning talking about yo 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 Alexander where's your mother Where's your mother? I know you up, but why are you on the game this early in the morning? So Alexander, as you all know, does not have a game in his room. Um, he The game is located in the family room. That's where it's gonna stay. He's not going to have any electronic whatsoever in his room. I'm not for it. Also too, as you guys know, my mother-in-law is officially here with us. Um, we do have a couple of more family members that will be coming to stay with us as well. So things are gonna get a little bit tight, but nonetheless, we're gonna keep everything under control. With respect, um, in the mist, love in the mist, we're gonna keep things um, under control. So yeah, he has to do his workout and then after his workout, um, I've realized that he still has access on his laptop. The school gave him his laptop for the summer, so he'll be doing freckles. He has math, um, phonics, and English. So basically, those three things, I split them three times during the day. So in the morning, he can choose which one he wants to do, either math, phonics, or reading. Um, also, too, we went to the library, so he picked up a few puzzles. We have three puzzles. Um, we have a solar system. We have a under the sea type puzzle and one more, um, a map, a world's map puzzle. So he can choose to do puzzle, he can do choose to do go on the trampoline. So I'm gonna show you guys the schedule when I get home. It's very, very informative, it's very, very helpful. Um, nonetheless, you just have to stay on top of the kids because you know they're very sneaky. When they don't see you, they're gonna wanna do what they wanna do. But um, I think that's gonna go very well. Erica, on the other hand, I don't really know if I want to give her a schedule, but I may have to give her a schedule because as you all know, she has her laptop now. Um, and I've seen, I mean, she's probably just getting used to the laptop and I don't want to be a, you know, uh, uh, yeah, that type of mom. So I'm letting her do her, um, nonetheless, yeah. We're going to get active. She says she doesn't want to go back to cheerleading this year. I didn't get a phone call from any of her coaches as well, so I'm not even going to push it. So um, that's supposed to start in August, which is next month. Nonetheless, she has been doing Pilates in her room. 
guys i have been talking for eight minutes but nonetheless it's very informative stuff hopefully you guys can you know take some tips and tricks and add some things to your agenda at your house in your home for your kids this summer is really really important maybe i'll just do a vlog for that just by itself you know how to go about the summer type thing all right so when i get to the house i'm going to show you guys what's in my bag and then i'm gonna go inside take out lala's hair and do what i said i was gonna do for the most part because i'm really really looking forward to keeping myself occupied with this whole situation that just happened i just know i gotta just brace myself for that phone call i gotta brace myself for that phone call and you already know that's coming three so this is gonna be a freaking roller coaster nonetheless have a good day guys i'll see you in a little bit guys so we're home and i'm just going to show you really quickly what i got um we have beads for your girl there we have it some beads we're gonna go blue um i got this little thing together because i can't find my box so i have to order another one from amazon um, I got me a foot scrub. Very, very important, eh? Because we wear sandals all summer. Um, some bobby pins. Nail filer. More bobby pins. And our oils. Avocado. Aloe vera. We are going to do the biotin. That's what we have here. I like to use this in the kids here when I'm styling. Um, this is the shampoo that I use and the conditioner. Yeah. Uh, some rubber bands to add. Just refill the rubber band thing container. And I love this comb, so I got it for Lala, a green one. She, I usually get black, but we did green today. All right, so that is that for the festivities. I'm gonna go ahead and see you guys inside the house later. So guys, anyway, I'm home and I said, let me take two minutes to show you guys the schedule that I created for my son. So let me show you guys what I created for him. And then I'm actually getting ready to purchase two online workbooks, printables for him, which is just spelling and grammar and writing. So he's pretty, he's pretty solid with the math, like he gets the concept, so I'm not worried about the math. But the penmanship, we need to work on that, so that's why I'm gonna do the grammar and writing. And yeah, do you see it? So this is the schedule that I created for him. As you can see, eight and nine, breakfast, make your bed, get dressed, um, nine to 10.30, morning school work, you know, you can pick a subject um, from 10.30 to 11.30. He goes outside and play, lunch, chores, creative time, you know, reading, rest time, family walk, scavenger hunt. Um, you know, we can do a puzzle, probably play a game or so, if anything. Uh, then we're gonna do some more school activities, um, either on his laptop, um, dinner is between five and six, move TV time, gotta include that for the children, and free TV time, family game time, bedtime. So I did get it from this website right here, I think happymombacks.com, something like that. But you can edit it, so you can just make it your own. So that's baby Lala on the iPad over there with all her festivities and whatever. So I said I was gonna show you guys that, so I wanted to make sure I showed you. Um, but yeah, nonetheless, see you later. Your girl's tired.
Mason, come. Go back. Home. All right, guys. So guess where I ended up at? I'm at the park with my daughter, Lala, Mason, and my nephews. My brother trapped me. He ditched me for basketball with my son. Mason, come here. Mason. And now I turn into a babysitter. So my son wants to play basketball in the fall, which I'm gonna allow him. I'm gonna register him early, but he's being trained by one of the best out there. Google him, Marco Morenci. Phenomenal, phenomenal basketball player. Played with a couple of leagues. And that's my brother. Um, for your college, play basketball. So your boy's getting right. But. Finish? Oh shoot! Uh-uh, you skipped the whole one. Come on, come on, come on. Pull yourself up. Pull yourself up. Pull yourself up. You, you, you're, you're hanging too long. That's it. Don't swing too hard. Just swing yourself a little bit enough and get across. One, go, 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 go. Two, push, push, push. Three, three. One more, one more, push yourself. Push, go ahead, push. Yeah, you did it. Hey. Lala, it's hot. Go, 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 Major. Lala. La. Don't go on them. Don't go on them. All right, guys. So we're leaving the park. We are drenched, sweaty, hot, stinky, all the above. I called dirty. Uh, your boy here was trained by one of the best of the best out there. So we'll see how long we can keep this up. Because tomorrow, on, on in September, we gonna be on somebody's court. Feel me? What? Yeah. But anyway. So guys, I never really get a chance to record when I'm trying to do baby girl's hair. She's getting her hair done. Hi. Say hey guys. Hi. Lala. <laughs> so you see this is our little setup. I'm over here getting educated, stay getting educated. And I'm doing her hair. This is my supplies here. This is our beads. Um, yeah, so I'm just sitting down here doing her hair. And now she's eating her noodles. And we're just pushing through. Yeah. But I never get a chance to show you guys the start. Or I always forget to just show you guys. So here I am showing you guys. It looks good. We went with blue this week. So I'll touch base when she's done. Yeah. Look at this kid. You got this on my so good wash to my 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 my
Mai buka are. Mai mai. Ashan mai mai. La fumée hein. Ah bah les yeux. En moi la fumée les yeux mieux vierge. Comprends? On va habituer avec la fumée. Bin achete mai bukane. When you see this video, I want you to comment down below. If you know, you know. If you Haitian, dim ko make up on mai kute kunya la na peida it. Dim bezin ko ne mai bukane we ba mai bui ni mai achete mai bukane. Bezin ko ne ko make up sa kute. Anali. Abton comment comment down below. If you know, you know. If you know, you know. Anyway, guys, I'm just sitting here playing with this girl. She said, no, 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 sit down, sit down, so she could be my doctor. So anyway, I was just roasting, me did I roast some corn outside, the bukane be my idea for my dad. <clears throat> one, thing, one thing a Latibonian is gonna do for you is eat some my bukane and Hi. Look at that hair, guys. So the hair is finished. Oh, let them see your hair, mommy. Where's your daddy? Look at you. Let me see the back of your head. Ooh, guys, I had to fight to do this hair. You like it? You cute? I'm cute. Ah, she cute. You cute, girlfriend. You cute. <laughs> I don't know what's up with that. How much numbers? How many is that? Three. Three. That's her like go-to thing. Y'all see how long her nails is, guys? Look at her nails. They're so long. I'm gonna cut them. What? Yeah, I'm gonna cut them for you and then put some nail polish. You want nail polish? Yeah. Yeah, girl. Anyway, I think I'm done with the vlog for today, so I'll see y'all tomorrow. Today's Thursday. Tomorrow's Friday. Bye. Bye. Today we're heading out and about, and we're taking you guys with us. You will see where we're going shortly. Shortly, you will see where we're going. But nonetheless, I hope you guys are enjoying your summer because it's summertime. It is official summertime break, and we finna be outside. Even though it's piping hot, we don't complain about the heat over here because we love the heat. Okay, we prefer the heat than the. Cold. Oh, what's it that? I like the cold. I like cold. You liar. I like the warm. Like so, so anyway, guys, let's go. What? What happened to you? <laughs> come, Lala. Lala, come here. She's excited. How do we get inside? You tell me. Please purchase your tickets in the art gallery. All right, let's go. All right, guys. So today we are heading to a museum. Everybody's excited. 
the art gallery. Oh, just when I thought I was recording, I wasn't. So guys, we are at a animation comic Disney Museum and I am super excited. So let's go. Come Lala. Guys, this is super dope. This is so nice. The experience was so nice. What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? Welcome back to the vlog. Today we came. I took my kids to. I be careful. I took my kids to a um, museum. Um, it's super dope, super 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 unique, as you guys would have saw or going to see. But uh, we're just out and about and making new memories. The kids are super excited. I will definitely be back. I definitely want to bring Daddy Ellie because he's into a lot of these things. He enjoys these type of adventures. And you can see my kids running behind me over there. My oldest is right there. And I'm right here. <laughs> but we're gonna head out. I'm gonna go get a bite to eat with them because they're hungry. So we're gonna go get something to eat. And then we're gonna head home. 
So it was about five o'clock. Everything closes at five. So we're heading home now. Um, afterwards, when we get to eat. But it was a nice day out. Yay. All right, so decided to get my kids Domino's because that's what they wanted. I don't know why I always do that when I come here. Thank you. Hi, G. G. Um, Domino's it is. All right, guys, so we got the pizza. We got the pizza. Um, I don't know if Alex is going to be able to hold it, but let's try. All right, guys. <laughs> guys? I'm going to quit Kaila. I'm going to quit Kaila. Okay? I'm going to quit Kaila. 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 Hey guys, pick that up. Happy Sunday, happy Sunday. We're at church this morning. Me and my children's. We at church this morning, so I'll touch base with you guys after church. <laughs> Me and my kiddos. Let's go. Yep. Alright guys, so everyone's here. We are here. And today we're at a museum. Let's see. Oh. Um, let's go. Let's go check this one out. Let's walk down to see that one over there. So I guess this is like some type of aircraft museum. Um, there's another one that we're gonna go to, another one. but not today. It's a bigger one. But I said let's come to this one because this one's only open on Saturdays and Sundays, and from 10 to 4. So it's smaller. It's intimate. But like these are old airplanes, old helicopters, jets, little small planes. I don't know if there's another name for them. But yeah, we're just here enjoying some time with family. Left side is the student, right side is the pilot. Oh, left side is the pilot. Except on a helicopter, it's backwards. Don't ask me why. Oh, okay. Very good. So what is this considered? This is a, just a Cessna 150. 
just a standard training plane. Oh, it's this still, plane yeah, was huh. used by a guy that used to fly above the um, 95 and tell you the traffic when I was a kid. In oh. the 70s, he used to report on the radio. Okay. He'd say, oh, back up uh, this exit. That's who used to fly this plane. Oh, okay. But this is a standard training plane. So okay. I'm so impressed this that you guys are doing it, Jim. I'm very impressed. So thank nice. you. Nice. You don't want to bang this around because it's right. Okay. No, you don't want to do that. You gonna go in with Lala, Alex, or you gonna go with Lala? You wanna go in? Erica's gonna go in. You wanna... Come on, take it. Scared of what? It's not gonna fly with the wings. Lala, gently, soft. Soft, baby. Move. See what you're doing? Look. Look over here. Look, it's moving. Turn the wheel. Oh, you gotta turn the wheel. See it? Well, we're not to turn the over there. Is that over one? Yeah, Alex, Alex, you can't wait for us. You down, just be who never say that. I don't want pipe down, ready to pay back. I'm a You don't want to find that jet? That is that, Mari. All right, you ready for takeoff? Yeah. <laughs> All right, Mari. Mari, you can't ever say you ain't never been inside of a little a little airplane. Wait a few minutes, Mari's having his turn. Alright, kid. What's he happy on? Alright, mommy, you're touching too much stuff. Okay, hey, you're going fast. You're going fast. Get ready for landing. You're gonna land the airplane. And yeah, but bravo. Whoa, not there. Look at the Mari in the back seat. Why, why doesn't he come in the plane? He likes him so much. Lala, be gentle, be gentle. Ooh, baby Lala. Why you pay? Lala, no, 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 no. No. Why you pay? Yeah. What? <laughs> yep, be gentle. Be gentle. This Where are you going? Where's this the doesn't have anything hooked up. None of the controls are hooked up. Okay. Yet. We just put this one together a couple weeks ago. Oh, put it together? Yeah, it was in pieces. Wow. This served in Vietnam. This was a Vietnam air airplane. You know that? That's, that's awesome. All right, Lala. All right, you ready for landing? All right. Okay, on where we're down. All right, let's go. Everybody's safe. Yay! <laughs> Come on. I go after Lala. What do you see in there? Go up one more. Maybe <laughs> you have to wait. I'm gonna go with you. All right, Mari, go ahead. Guys, I'm super scared. Go ahead. You cannot go inside. No, just stand right here. Stand right here. Get down? No, you can't sit down. Wow. Scared? Yeah. Alright, go ahead, go down.
Oh, this is a this is a landscape of what this place used to look like. Don't touch, guys. Get your hands off the mirror. Alright guys, so nonetheless, as you saw earlier, I um, took my kids to church today and then I went home and cooked a bite to eat and then today we went to visit a museum, Alexander, hmm? and, uh, oh those are airplane airplanes. So we're gonna head home. I think I'm gonna leave you guys right here for today. And I'll pick up with you guys tomorrow. If you are here for the first time, welcome. I hope you enjoy this vlog. And if you're returning, you already know what's up, Gems Babe. Nonetheless, make sure you like, share, and subscribe. We are growing slowly but surely. But we already know how gems do. We multiply. Period. And say hi to my husband, guys, in the comment section below. Hi. Are you my husband? Say hi, hubby. Anyway, you guys enjoy the rest of your Sunday. It's about to start pouring, and we're about to be home. Pop some popcorn, watch a movie or two, and then get ready for the work week. So. So you guys know it wouldn't be me if I didn't have to make a stop. We're at Walmart. I came to get a case of water because where we are, there's like a shortage of water. So I need to get a case of water. So we're running in here to get that. And then we're gonna head home. It's a bad joke. See me say sayo? Alright guys. I'm in my husband's car because he is not feeling well today. It is Monday. Hubby's not feeling good. So, he was off today. Anyway, today he was off. And really quickly, I'm just touching base with you guys. Um, I did absolutely nothing today. My mom just said, let's go out. Um, so let's step out real quick. She want to go to Burlington and Walmart. So we're going to do that when I get back. I'm going to go gas up my husband's car for tomorrow. Because he said he doesn't want to go back out today. So I'm doing this right now. Because at least when I go out my car, as I'm coming in, I can gas up. So we're going to go put gas in my hubby's vehicle. I really wish I can get an iced coffee right now. I feel for iced coffee because it's so hot. But nonetheless, see you in a little bit. <laughs> just Google it. Just, just Google it. Just Google it. Just, just Google it. Mom, say hi to my vlog. Hi. How are you? Say hi, mom. It's too hot, you can't talk? Okay. Mucho caliente. <laughs> she can't. I have can't. to buy anything Yes, walk in here. <laughs> <laughs> she came for free AC. Yeah. If you know about free AC, then you know yeah, you came from the struggle. Walk. Free. Free AC. Yeah. 
Anyway, guys, we in Burlington real quick. Came to look at some stuff for the dresser. Um, and I'm gonna look at some sheets. I feel like we need that sheet. But I haven't been here in a while, so. I've been trying to stay out of the store shopping because you know we're about to go back to school shopping for the kids, for the children, so. Erica was asking me for a notebook just the other day. I'm in love with planners, but guys, this is fire. See that? That is fire. But God, all things are possible. This is cute. Oh, well, true. They probably can't get them here because if it's not, this is if it has to be. It has to be 120. That's too much glam. That's for young people. Twenty dollars probably. Let me see. Yeah, twenty bucks. But I said you need 120. So guys, I am home. I definitely forgot to pick back up the camera. Look at baby Lala. She's sitting down eating. Um, we got Chipotle. I don't know if you can see. I have my burrito. Guac. It's really, really dark. So I just wanted to check in with you guys and let you guys know that I'm home. And where did we go? We ended up going to Burlington, Marshall's, Dollar Tree, Chipotle, Chick-fil-A, and to get gas. <laughs> so I'm home, but you guys have a blessed night. I'm going to check back in with you guys tomorrow. Tomorrow's Tuesday. I'm thinking I'm going to close the vlog tomorrow, but we'll see when tomorrow comes. My mom want to touch the road. She want us to go. Go and touch the road, so. Manana. Mwah. All right. Come this way. Mm -mm. Lala, huh? let Kyrie get a chance. Move, mm -hmm. move your foot. So here these are my mom's mint tea, tea bomb. We have beans over there on that side. Ah. Over here. Ah. The kids are watering. Come this way, Kyrie. Come this way. Come this way. Kai, come this way. Jesus Christ. Baba. Go that way. Turn it that way. This way. So the kids are watering my mom's garden. First off. Say hi Lala. What's up? Yeah. <laughs> Mommy, Kylie did it. Yeah. He's ready. He's watering the garden. Yeah. All right, we almost finished. I the garden. You watering the garden? Go closer. Go closer. Good job. Lala, up. Gotta get those over there. Guys, the mint smells so good. Mama, you good? The mint smells mm -hmm. so good. We 
channel that's where my kids are my husband what we do activities we go on it's summertime so um we're actually going to be hitting up a lot of festivities when i can i think i kind of burnt myself out last week um i want to say last week we hit up three museums we did three museums last week um that was a lot and you know it entails a lot of walking so that was a bit much but anyway we did it the kids were so happy super super excited i can't wait to to do so much more i actually found a i'm not going to tell you guys here but that's for the family channel nonetheless welcome back to the vlog it is wednesday i want to say july 12th or july 13th i think it's the 12th let me check july 12th so my son was like mama mama it's prime day shit i was like god damn it because <sighs> i was tapped out yesterday i couldn't even look at nothing for nothing about nothing to see about nothing okay so today is prime day anyway we're on the road and i'm going to walmart my mom not feeling so good so i'm about to go get her some some meds from Walmart actually she's like her stomach is hurting whatever so I think it's gas you know all Caribbean people every time something hurt they think it's gas it could be in their neck be in their back be in their stomach it could be in their arm is gas <laughs> but anyway um I'm running to Walmart real quick and then I'm gonna come back to Kohl's because I gotta drop off a return for Amazon and then we're gonna hit up big Y really quickly so I can get some fruits and stuff for the kids um, cause Lala's bugging me for apples and stuff. So we're going to do that. So that's what we're on the road doing. I'm jamming to my music. So I'm going to hit you guys back up later. Hopefully I remember to pick up the camera. We are definitely closing the vlog today so we can, um, so we can get ready for tomorrow to drop the vlog. Nonetheless, make sure you like, share, subscribe, tell, tell, tell a friend about your girl Gemma. Um, Gemma's Gems. Um, I really, really, really appreciate you guys. Um, it would be greatly appreciated if you watch the videos full through. Um, also, if you guys can like the video, that also is a big help. Um, and nonetheless, comment. Leave a comment down below. Like, I I would like to interact with some of um, my followers. I do appreciate you guys a lot um and yeah just make sure you follow me on all social media platforms instagram facebook tiktok we are present not actively present but we are present um and yeah all right so we made it to walmart so let's go in there it's piping hot guys
All right, guys, so while I was in Walmart, my phone rings and I get a call from Lala School. So your girl is officially starting school next week. So that's the good news. I was breaking to Daddy Ellie and he hits me with the, oh, that means she's not gonna have no summer. The hell she is Saturday and Sunday. Um, I'm gonna talk to them and see if you know if she has to go every day. And then, like I said, for the summer hours, I'm just gonna make her go for like maybe four or five hours from like 8 30 to 12, like that, and then pick her up. And then starting September, she'll do the full 8 30 to 4 30. Since I am taking Amari, it'll be a good thing that she goes to school. There we go. I'm in pain. My back is hurting me, but I'm still outside. But um, we're done with Walmart. We're heading to Kohl's. Yeah, we're gonna go to Kohl's now to do the return. So let's go. I'll see you at Kohl's. So by the way guys, I hate this music so has been bugging me that her spray was done so I just grabbed one for her so um yeah let's go we're going to big wide pick up some fruits and then we're heading home all right we're heading into big Y you guys know that if it ain't Sam's, it's Big Y Fruits for me. And I'm not going all the way to Big Sam's Club today, so we're going to grab some stuff here because it's your girl Lala. She want to strangle me because she want apple. Mommy, apple. Mommy, apple. So, we're here. By the way, guys, as you saw, I was telling Daddy Ellie about... Um, phone call we got for Lala to start school next week and he's like he thought I was talking about he thought I was talking about Erica 
What? He said he thought I was talking about Erica. I said, you got to be kidding me. Like, definition of a joke. Okay, definition of a joke. Strawberries do not look yummy. Let's see. to go to Dollar Tree but I'm gonna go home because I bought two things of ice cream um, so I'm gonna go home and then that's it for today for me I do believe I'm gonna leave you guys right here we're not doing nothing else for today um, so we know that Lala's going to school next week so this weekend we're definitely gonna be out and about trying to get her some stuff, going to Target I'm thinking 
in Target Children's Place. Not even Children's Place. I think Children's Place is time. Maybe Ch Target and Carter's. Target and Carter's. And then Marshall Johnson or she did not turn those for some shoes for her. Maybe like two or three pairs or whatever. It's still summertime, so I'm not too worried. And then, you know, you gotta get your girl her lunchbox. Um, not lunchbox, but her book bag. Make sure she has her accessories, her necessities for school. She's still a diaper. Um, she does tell you that she wants to go to the bathroom. She's very, very shy when you are there with her. And, but I don't think it's gonna take her long. I don't think it's gonna take her that long to transition to officially not wearing the diapers. So I'm not too worried about that. However, thank you very much, you too. Um, however, I do think before September, she's going to be completely done with that. That's if they don't baby her at the school. So if they don't baby her at the school and she's motivated to come out of that, but just like all the other kids, by like going to the bathroom and stuff, she'll be out of diapers before the month of August. Before the end of August, I should say. So anyway, we're going to end the vlog here. And we're going to edit this video. And then from there, we're going to post this video. And then I'm going to see you guys in the next episode. But until then, y'all go ahead and stay blessed. Don't forget to thank God for what he's done, what he's doing, and what he's getting ready to do in your life. Because when he shows up, he shows out.